Boy, oh boy, do I have a special one today. Today, we play a game from the creators of Summer of 58. We played it a while ago. It was an extremely good game. Let's see what this game has to offer. Jump in head first. Do a bit of a taste test. Make sure it's thick and saucy. What's up, guys and gals? Welcome to the Outer Middle Show. Mad Vlad is the name. And Father's Day is the game. And in today's episode, I already told you what we're doing. We're jumping into Father's Day. You guys got to hear this. Listen to the menu music. Wow. Amazing. Anyway, sorry. Now that's menu music I can listen to. <laughs> okay, I know nothing about this game other than it's called Father's Day. No research. You know how we do it. Let's hit new game. We'll see if it's of any count. Damn, achievement unlocked. Welcome. Hope you guys remember the last game I played. Let's hope this one is just a bit better. Here we go. I'm really, I'm really hard on that dude, but... Do you blame me? This is uh, interesting. We got a red door, a house, very far away, and it is pitch black. Oh, wow. Okay, let's just keep moving. This already sucks. This. I'm just going to keep moving. Oh, God. Okay. What? What makes people go back to the past? Why can't they let him go and move on? Good question. Why? What, the father? Parental home, first date. Family picnic. Going to the city fair with a child. These are warm memories, but only if you are happy now. And if not, then these memories tear your soul apart. Do not let go. You want to go back there and be happy again, but you can't. I, I'm not in control of the dialogue. Oh, how to fix one fatal mistake that changed your world. I don't know how. Phil, you have to. But do I really? Act one. The past cannot be changed. Free the future. That's true though. Oh, achievement unlocked to act one. They just give away achievements these days. I want to let you guys know that I finally took a shower. I know. <laughs> I know. All right. After two weeks of working really hard, let me know down in the comment section how proud you are of me. Because I really want to know. Oh, man. I got to get in the zone. Deep breath in. We're not scared. We can't be scared. We're men. 
know what I'm talking about. Can I get a hell yeah, brother? Sorry. Okay, right off the bat, I just want to say, running smooth as butter, almost too smooth. Wait a minute, come on, man. I already know this hallway. This is a reprint, but it's a beautiful reprint. Having a bit of trouble with the mouse. It's very smooth. We're going to check the graphics and the mouse settings. Okay, so there's no uh, settings for motion blur. It's got a bit of motion blur, blur but it's not bad, so we're just going to leave it. This is a reskin, though. Never mind. I know this corner. That's all I'm saying. Ooh, everything is so buttery crisp so realistic man this is this is photo realistic i can't wait till they start putting out games on the new unreal engine actually i can wait because games already make me crap my pants as is maybe this isn't a reskin i was wrong okay room one 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 two yeah, we can't open any of these doors. I'm hearing flies, though. Yeah, there's something dead in there. One, 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 four. Okay. Hello? Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Okay, I'm leaving! Leave me alone! All right! I was just making sure your uh, toilet was... I'm leaving. Bye. You're literally yelling at nothing. Oh my god. Sorry. I'll go I'll go away. What the hell is that about? What is that? Oh, that's my apartment. Okay. That's the doorbell to my apartment. They look different, though. Okay. Well, let's... Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe there's something back here that we missed. We were on the shitter. That's where this game started. We cannot run. Uh, we're just going to inspect around, make sure we didn't miss anything. It is uh, 38 o'clock. What do we got here? A boy who disappeared six days ago was found by local residents. It was discovered in an abandoned hut outside the city, near the park. According to the boy, he was kidnapped by a man dressed as a clown. Oh my god. When he was on a holiday with his father. Let's dismiss that. There is a manic operating in our area who kidnaps children. Great. Great. Maybe that same uh, maniac. Did I say manic or maniac? I can't remember. Doesn't matter. Well, let's piss the dogs off again. It won't let us. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look. No, we can just do a zoom look. Yeah, won't let us do that again. All right. Exit. I didn't see that before. No, won't let us exit. Very, very interesting. Nothing here. Maybe there's something... I don't know why our door's open. Aha. Uh -huh. Flashlight. Excellent. Definitely gonna need that. There we go. It's one of those old-timey flashlights. You know, I want one of these. I want it like a really old-timey flashlight. They're pretty cool. So, based on the technology... I can tell this is maybe 80s. That door closed. I heard another door open. I don't remember there being a door there. There is no time to be distracted. You need to continue working on the project. Am I stupid? I don't remember there being a door there. The project, huh? I've spent several years developing a time machine. I'm almost close to completion. Uh, awesome. So we must finish it. Does not work. There is not enough detail. Need to pick up the order. 
I think I read that right. Need to pick up the order. For my son. Okay. There's nothing really we can do with this. We can't flip it around. We can't spin it. it just says for my son. My vision got blurred for a second. That's weird. Okay. Nothing we can do in here. I'm just thoroughly checking everything. Nothing through there. Let's turn our light back on. I'm hearing a sound. A strange sound. There's the phone's ringing. Okay. It sounded like somebody knocked on that door. Is that my doorbell? Man, bro, the sounds in this are incredible. I did not mean to do that. I was going to look through the peephole, but... Okay, the delivery guy's walking away. Okay. Maybe I should close the door. Maybe I shouldn't. I really hate that sound. If I lived in an apartment and I heard that sound... I would leave. So the clock is actually keeping time. I don't know. The hell is that? Is that a fuse? Where does this go? So I, I ordered something apparently. Sure. Sure thing. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's go back to the gladiator days and uh, maybe join an orgy. I don't know. No, my fucking Is the universe infinite? Boy, oh boy, the sounds. Have you ever heard that, uh, that knocking prank sound? That's what, like, every sound in this game is like. Cool, door's locked. So we did travel through time. Um, whether or not we went forward or backwards, not sure. Not sure. The, dude, look at the reflection of my flashlight off the screen. That's insane. Oh! Oh! He's got a baphomet on his chest with the red eyes. That's... Oh, we can turn it. Flip it. Okay. I'm just going to put that down. Not seeing anything different on the boards. Sweet. Act two. They thought it was safer inside. Henry. Henry, look around this house. There's a missing child in the park nearby. We need any leads. My papa's name was Henry. Henry accepted. Man, when I was standing still, I thought that was like a load screen. Fuck. I forgot my flashlight. You might need that. Okay, so we are a police officer. Well, we don't have a flashlight. He said I forgot my flashlight. Okay. So there is a fair or a amusement park right next to this house. That would be pretty cool. Pumpkins. Two dollars. Two dollars for a pumpkin? They take all year to grow, though. The police open the door. There's a flashlight. I will take that. Yeah, no, nothing. Here's something swinging in there. 
Oh my god, this game is insane. Holy crap. Henry, open the door. Come on, man. This is an ordinary abandoned house. No one has lived here for a long time. Okay. Take a look around. I will. I will. Man, we need dialogue in this game. It's too good to not have dialogue. I hate reading. Um, either those are mannequins or someone was born without a head but has a fat ass. They're mannequins. Okay. I'm pretty sure I would have noticed that. Hey, did you know these pumpkins are like two dollars? Is that what that what you guys came here for? Oh, okay. I'm just gonna look around some more. Um, don't know quite what I'm seeing out there. Looks like a giant person. Yeah. Oh, here's a mobile home. Let's check it. Or a trailer, whatever you want to call it. Yep. Nope. Nothing there. Well, wait a minute. Okay, we didn't go this way. Hey, a ship box. Boarded up. Okay. Oh my God. Out. Two dollar pumpkins. That way. I'm just trying to be nice. Oh, cool. It's the uh, Necronomicon. A cup of blood. And a swamp? Okay. Well, we can't pick nothing up or interact with anything, but it looks like somebody was performing a ritual. Nice family. Nice family. Cool. That is one big ass Ferris wheel. Yeah, oh, fucking hell. Just want to let you guys know my headphones are way up. They always are. People are always like, it wasn't that scary, Vlad. Vlad, you're a big... You're a big sissy. I'm actually not. What the hell was that? Ooh. Hello? You stuck in the shitter? Happens to the best of us. All right, man. All right, we're just we're just gonna keep going. Oh, the door's open. He's in there shitting. I hear a record player. Someone's sitting upstairs. Need to find a ladder to climb to the attic. Hey, I see you up there. Boy, can you imagine being a cop and walking into this scenario? It would really suck. I'd quit. Come on now. There's pizza right here. Are those worms? Yeah, that's, that's old pizza. Okay, well, let's find a ladder. Interesting. This is, uh... This is starting to get to me. Like, I feel that the comedic juice is leaving my body. And, and the more that I'm in this game, I feel as though the more jumpy I'm getting. You can tell that I'm off when I space my words out a lot. I'll, I'll start a sentence and then I'll stop. And then I'll, I'll concede. I just did it. <laughs> Somebody moved the uh, satanic worshiping shrine. Well, let's go back. This is one of those games where you gotta you gotta move around. Stuff changes all the time. Ladder. There it is. There we go. Looks like I can burn the ropes. What does that say? Why would you want to burn the ropes? Need to find matches and gasoline. What? Why? Just untie them. 
my god! It's okay. I, I didn't really scare me. I was just kidding. I was, I was just pulling your chain. Matches? And gas? What? Why would you need gasoline? Here's the gasoline. Take. Now we need some, uh... Need some spark. What is this? Circus performance. This Sunday. Happy Father's Day. Achievement unlocked. We are waiting for you. Father's Day, huh? Well, I don't get it. So that's a circus? That makes no sense. Dude, I thought that was behind me. God, dude, you guys have to play this game just for the atmosphere. It's nuts. Got another one of these cards. I'm waiting for you. Awesome. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. I saw the fire and was like, <laughs> didn't even like pay it no mind. I'm not the smartest guy in the world, that's for sure. Hearing lots of noises. There we go. And it's gone. Why? Oh my god! Why mannequins, man? At least they got fat asses. This is the fat ass mannequin game. Uh oh. Oh god. Fah, fucking creepy place. No! Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm not moving. I'm not moving. The culprit in the accident on Highway 58 testified. I definitely saw that the girl ran out onto the road to pick up her toy. I wanted to get away from the collision. The culprit was intoxicated and does not remember what happened after the accident. Recall that as a result of the accident, the car caught fire. A woman and a child could not get out of the car. Yay! The house is clean. There's no evidence. The house is not clean. There's a Ouija board right there. Henry, get back to the base. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No! Oh, my God. I hate this. That's sexual assault. She tried to grab my ass. Oh my god, that is- no! Sure. That mannequin party. That mannequin had eyelids. Like real ones. Oh my god. I'm surrounded by fat ass mannequins. Okay, well- That's not a fucking mannequin. That's not a mannequin. <sighs> okay. We'll do it your way. Sir! Can't be out here! Ah! Oh, God! Oh, my God! Can I please leave? Please? I'm going out the front door. Fuck, I hate- I hate that. I hate it. It has eyelids. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Uh. Alright, let's go around. Nope. Guess there's no going around. Alright. Oh, the table's back. Sweet. Um, dolls. Okay, cool. I guess the uh, old Jethro got sucked into the uh, lake by an alligator. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm clueless. You know, why, why not sailor dive over the fence? Why? Okay, we got, we got to find a way out of here. We've got to get out of here. Maybe the shitter. We'll sleep in the shitter until the mannequin party's over. 
Okay, I didn't know you could walk out here. Oh, no. I think I found something. Yep, you found something, all right. Police Sergeant Hendry Anderson. He was sent to inspect the surroundings of the park, but during the operation, he stopped contacting. Caught a lead pipe. Act three, your nightmare is reality. This is going to get bad. I know for a fact this is going to get really, really bad. Phil, AM, 327. Okay, achievement unlocked, Act 3. Whew. Let's do this. Uh, here we go. Don't have my flashlight. Candles on the floor. Yes. Oh my fucking god. It's my grandma's saggy nip. She had a saggy nip. Oh, we've got TVs and leather couches now. Excellent. Excellent. Nothing. It, oh, yeah. It, I don't know, man. It seems like every time we appear in this apartment. It's drastically changed. So what I'm thinking is we might be in a different time, maybe? Or another dimension? Okay, the numbers are backwards. Emma hasn't sorted her mail yet. Need to replace the envelopes. Um, there's a hand. I'm hearing heavy breathing. Either somebody's playing with the magic wand, or there's a guy in there with her. Your brother, Jonathan. Locked, need a key. Yeah, somebody's doing the do. Get out of my house! Not in your house, ma'am. No comment. She's doing something in there. Let's uh, check the basement, maybe. Locked. Okay. Okay. I'm going to check the closet one more time. Okay. Nothing. Nothing over here. Just our flashlight. Can't check the drawers. A lot of blood in the sink. Bloody clothes. What is that? It looked like a key. Okay. Pictures are backwards. Just now noticing that. Let's ring this doorbell. Won't let us. Oh. We did. Oh. Emma, I'm so sorry. I want to help you find JJ. But I can also ensure you that the boy was just playing with friends and didn't and didn't warn you. He'll be back soon, your neighbor Phil. Okay. I didn't know that we could read that. Just read that. Alright, alright. Pretty sure that triggered something. Maybe now. Yeah. No. We still need to find the key to that box. This is very strange. All right. Yep, it triggered something. Yeah, definitely triggered something. That, my friends, is a demon. 
with a leg growing out of his ass. Yay. Oh, yay. Yay. Cool pictures. We are definitely in the spirit world. Or not the spirit world, but a demonic place. That's where we are. It's okay. Didn't get me. Uh, bald rats and baphomets and that thing. Mammal. Saggy nipple. Okay. Yeah. A lot, lot of demonic shit. What the hell is this? Need to find the missing part. Okay. It looks like a bear. Need to find a bear. Just gonna run. I knew one of these TVs would be on. I knew it. It's moved. Yeah. Oh my god, things have changed. I'll take that. It's time to light the candles. Uh, okay. What candles? Open two times. I'll pass. Oh my god. Yep, no bathroom. Yeah, I got pentagrams hanging up everywhere. Sounds like old girl is, uh, not playing with her wand anymore. And everything is backwards, so this is kind of like a as above, so below type deal. Can't ring the doorbell. This sucks. I don't know if those were there before. No, they definitely weren't. Unless I'm stupid. Okay, open two times. Achievement unlocked, the lion. Which the magic cabinet. We didn't find a piece. Oh man, this is one hell of a puzzle game, dude. Okay, so I'm seeing a lot of wires go to the picture. I don't know if that has any significance. Okay, safe. Need to light the candles to open the door. All right. One. There's two. There's three. There's four. Got the key to the box, I'm assuming. And all kinds of shit's about to start happening. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hello? nice teddy bear uh you're possessed by a demon I'm just gonna let you know that oh my god and she's gone didn't see that one coming oh there's a baby doll let me guess yes a bear piece oh shit Oh, shit. Locked. Okay. Yeah, we're fucked. We are fucked. Okay. Let's observe everything. Gotta be missing something. Okay. Maybe the box. Yes, the box. Yep, there, yep, there's a demon right next to us. And it's moving the box for us. Those are hooves. Definitely, oh God. Ah! 
I'm all right. Mm, fat ass mannequin. It's that. It's that one mannequin. I hate that mannequin with every single fiber of my being. That is, I mean, look at it. Look at the joints on it. That's not a regular mannequin, dude. And it's got eyelids. At some point, that mannequin is going to open its eyes and make us shit our pants. What the hell is that? Yeah, cool. Wow. Amazing. Nice skull. Okay, well, let's open the door twice. There we go. Those look like intestines. Somebody's shit box got tore out. All right, Barry. Oh, no, no. <sighs> yeah, whatever. Whatever, dude. I don't even care anymore. What does this remind me of? I don't want to turn around. This reminds me of that uh, one of the first horror games I ever played, the the painting horror game. Oh shit! Oh shit! What the hell was that game called? And I yeah, <laughs> I knew it. Layers of fear. That's what it was called. Maybe I need to replay that game. It's like we have a code. Okay, need a password, and there is that creepy-ass mannequin with a fat ass. Okay. Well, going back. And... Okay, we're clear. Looking for a code. That's terrible. Horror. This is the end. It's here. You can kiss my ass. That is one well-built mannequin, though. Hey, I've got the missing piece here, so I'm just going to play with this. If you don't mind. One. Four. Zero. Eight. One four zero 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 eight. Okay. One four. Oh, hey. Thank you, sir. Holy intestines. It smells like shit in here. Oh, yeah. The Grim Reaper. What's up, Mr. Reaper? Either I'm hearing shit fall out of these intestines, or there's something else in this room with me. Okay. Need a key. Oh, God, it stinks. Okay. Let's see. We're missing a switch. What if we can leave? Yes, we can. Hell. Yeah, I get it. You know, my uh, vision of hell would be something like this. Never-ending torture. And, like, figuring out puzzles that have like no end to them. That's scary. For the rest of eternity, you're just like in something like this. How insane would that be? 
That that would be my version of hell. Oh hell. Oh God. Hey, uh, fat ass mannequin, can you protect me? Key. Oh God. I'm just gonna take this key if you don't mind. Stupid ass closet. Close. There we go. Okay, we're good. Got the key. We're gonna be okay. Father's Day, right? It's Father's Day. Okay, open the box. What's in the box? The lever. I knew it. Let's go home. Yep. Go! Oh, God! Creator, I want to hear the truth. Act four, the golden egg. How many acts are there? The golden egg is a virtual world created from the memories and actions of certain of a certain person and we also analyze what he is afraid of in order to use it in the future the next stage is putting a person's mind into a virtual world so he thinks that everything he sees around him is real then we connect to the consciousness of a person and try to find out what secrets he keeps in our egg we have created a space for a maniac so that he will not be able to distinguish reality from the virtual world and will think that this is his life while he is distracted our task is to dig into his memories of this case to do this we will connect a person who will explore his world and record evidence for us together with the distinct police together with the district police we are launching the system Communication with Henry has been interrupted. He no longer gets in touch. That's weird. Okay, so is this created? Henry got beyond the golden egg. Only a maniac knows where he is now. We need a person who has already been to this place in reality. He himself will not get out of this world. Okay. It's starting to make sense now. So in this reality, mental reality that they've created... Uh, we're calling Jonathan Wade. We somehow crossed over into a demonic realm. Act 5. Be careful. Evil knows where to look for you. Ain't that the truth? Okay. Act 5. Achievement unlocked. Jonathan, show me how it was. But don't go beyond the boundaries of the world. It's dangerous. Okay. Jonathan. I was in this place 20 years ago. It's like it was yesterday. Okay, so we're still in Jonathan's memories. Or we're in Jonathan's memories. We're back at that one place next to the uh, circus. I need my video camera. Okay. Check. Oh, no. Now we're looking like Outlast. Yeah, but we never went in there. Okay. Oh boy, this this game uh, creator never disappoints. That's for sure. Never disappoints. I love story-driven horror. Love it. I'm just going to say, man, good job, man. Devs, good job. Seems to be locked from the inside. Okay. Do I have to use my camera? Okay. I was too terrified to turn around. Okay. That's how we zoom. I'm assuming we don't have a flashlight. Oh, that is our flashlight. Okay. I get it. So we are recording... Can't go through there. Told us not to leave the boundary. I just don't quite know what we're looking for. Whew. 
Oh my god. I say that a lot, and I'm sorry. Can't go in there. Okay. Another one of these. I'm waiting for you. Okay, same stuff. All right. Oh! that That's just fantastic! Just fantastic. That's just fantastic. Excuse me, ma'am. Uh. That's the most creepy thing I've ever seen in my life. Never, never mind. I'm getting a knot in my throat. It's getting hard to swallow. I, I gotta take a drink. Oh my god. Same. Sorry. Sorry. I'm assuming it's going to be gone. I'm hoping. It's gone. No surprise. Just going to keep moving. Oh. Oh. Arrow. Oh, baby doll. Crowbar. So I'm sorry. I'm sorry if that was your crowbar. I, I got to take it. I got to bust through this lock. See what's in this dungeon. Now I feel bad. I took that baby's crowbar. Oh my God, dude, this sounds... Okay. That was not here before. Whatever. Let's break this. It looks like we're going to need a key. Maybe maybe we needed this crowbar to bust through the door. That would make more sense. Alright. I hate that, like, our field of view is only so far out. Seems to be locked from the inside. Yeah, you have a crowbar, big dog. Maybe the front door. Let's go investigate. Oh my fucking god! Ma'am, are you okay? Um. Ma Ma'am. Wow. It's a nice dress you have on. Very, very nice. What, what are you looking at? It's almost like she's trying to look at, like, a dozen flies at once. <laughs> okay. Ah! I know better than that. At least you would think. Can't get to the front door. There we go. There we go. Come on, hit me with a pipe. anyone here uh what the fuck oh my god <sighs> the hell is that it's him achievement unlocked it's what god please turn that off I need to burn the rope. I hear a fucking choo-choo train. Lighter fluid, gotcha. I'm guessing we're going to have to go upstairs to uh, find a lighter or matches. I, I know something's about to go down. 
He was here. He was hidden. Need to find how to open the safe. There's the lighter. Okay. Getting the hell out of here. Oh, what's, I don't get this whole burning rope thing. Wow, that's cool. It's actually a good idea for a decoration. Get a bunch of baby doll heads and you melt wax on them. I'm going to do that next Halloween. That's pretty lit. Don't take my idea, okay? I thought of it first. Okay. What? Going on. Can't go that way. So we need to find a key. And I've just got this weird feeling that the key is going to be maybe... Yeah. I was wrong. All right. Going back here. You know, I'm not going to make very many cuts to this game because it's just such a smooth an awesome game that uh, I want you guys to pick up every single second of it. Oh God, what did I do? Gross. I said I wasn't gonna cut and then I cut. Come on, bro. Need to look for gloves. There's something there. Yeah, the key. I get to stick my hands in shit. Fantastic. Oh, God, it stinks in there. And I'm assuming maybe we've got to light this candle. <laughs> oh, my God. It's impossibly dark. Light this candle, burn down the wax sculpture. <laughs> Get the glove? I don't know. This is stupid. Let's check in here. Yeah, so baby rats that are still alive on a uh, cooking pan. Never had that dish before, but I'd like to try it. There we go. Got the glove. Let's go play in shit. I hate this. We're just gonna go. Grab that shit key. <laughs> I took out the access card. The access card? The hell are we gonna do with an access card? So it's a shit card. Oh, fuck that! No! Oh, my God! <sighs> I told you, man. I told you. I hate the limited view on this camera. I'm not going that way. I don't know why I'm doing this. I know that this isn't the right thing to do. Yep, definitely is not. We found an access card. I have no idea what it goes to. Oh, oh. Yeah. Okay, there we go. I didn't find the diary in reality. I need to dive into it and find out what happened to him as a child. Why is he... Hiding these memories. Okay, I came home after school. My mom was in a bad mood. I had to sit in the basement again. Cool. I read it. Oh my god. Achievement unlocked home sweet home. We're running. There's something in the top left corner. Oh, fuck! God damn it, you stupid bitch. I don't have my flashlight. 
That is terrifying. My God, but she's got a nice rack. Uh, and the upstairs window went out. Oh, God. Flashlight. I got it. And she's going. Coming to the house. I <laughs> don't want to. I'm leaving. Yeah, it won't let me. All right. Here we go. Hey, hey. Jonathan, you've gone too far. Do you know or do you want to know the truth? I'll tell you. Please do. Please. Please tell me the truth. You fucking creepy bitch. And what the fuck is that? Hello? What the hell? What the hell are you, bro? What the hell are you, bro? That's possibly the creepiest thing I've ever seen in my life. Hello? Uh, yeah, you're locked in, buddy. God, this game is just so good looking. It's fucking terrible. You, uh, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I recognize this, and you should recognize this too. This is a, a, a reskin. I cannot believe I'm man I'm blown away dude I don't know why I'm blown away but I know this house I especially know this kitchen and this dining room and I know this is a pantry I told you I told you this is a model for one of the houses on Miss Survival and what I don't understand is how it looks this good in this game. But yet it looks like absolute shit in Miss Survival. This is nuts! This is a Miss Survival house. Why does it look so good? See, we were looking for ammo and food in these drawers. Oh, damn. I know who lives here. Morgan! This is Morgan's house. Morgan! What in the hell is that? Oh, it's Morgan as a child. Morgan, let your mom in! Very strange. Very, very strange. Okay. Come on, Morgan, man. Let her in. She made you some amazing meatballs and spaghetti. And eggs! Okay, let's... I'm going to let her in, Invisible Morgan. Okay, let's go back and look. You can, you can come in. All right, whatever. There's a big mirror right here. Okay, we can't go in here. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Need to find a crowbar. Thought we already had one. Guess not. That's... That's creepy. Okay, we need to uh, yeah, we need to find a crowbar. Okay, and she's pointing upstairs, so uh I 
I can't get through. Oh, maybe I can. Okay, made it upstairs. I know this house, man. I know the layout of this house. What do we got here? Okay. Oh, no. Press C to turn on the camera. Please don't do that to me. Achievement locked up. I've got a feeling that... Morgan! Op open the door. You need to eat your meatballs. <laughs> yes, yeah, same bunk bed. Phil. No oh, shit! This kid is not Phil. And who is it? Phil McCrevis? I don't know. Now I feel like I'm in Miss Survival. Oh fucking hell! That sucked. And there's that woman outside in the very tempting dress. Very beautiful dress. Morgan. Come on, man. I don't care anymore. Didn't find a crowbar. Keep on moving. Now, wait a minute. Oh, okay. Thoroughly searching everything. Pumpkins, two dollars. Damn, nice ass. Oh, great. We got another lock. Fantastic. bar out of here. What is this? Lock picking tools. I actually know how to use these. I found the lock picks. Okay. So what can we lock pick? Possibly these. This would these well no, these are different. Now, those are satanic locks. We can't lock pick those. Those are going to be on there for a while. Let's go back upstairs. Hmm. Okay, let's try to get let's try to get in the store. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh my God! You fucking son of a dick! Um. Crowbar. There's a crowbar on the grave. Okay. Gotcha. Lock picks are probably for the gate. I fucking hate you. Just searching around here, making sure there's no stone unturned. Oh. Phil, my son, me and dad wanted to help you so much. We moved into a new house in the hope that everything would change. But evil possessed you, and we didn't know how to deal with it. Terrible things begin to happen. Killing birds and animals, it wasn't your fault. You were held hostage by a monster. I wanted to get rid of him. It's not good. Not good. So Morgan has been killing birds. What the hell is that? Puzzle piece. Can't go through that door. Okay. Let's go. Let's see if we can pick the lock on that gate. in the Miss Survival House. That'd be crazy. This game just turned into Miss Survival. Oh, look at this. I didn't see this before. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Maybe it wasn't here before. I don't know. Hi, right, how's it going? <laughs> you... Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, hello there. Hi. Don't you dare. Don't fucking do it. What do we have here? I have no idea what the hell that was. Maybe a lock to the basement? I don't know. Don't do it. Don't you fucking do it. Don't do it. Okay. I'm going to turn around. Okay, we're good. We're okay. We're going to be fine. Oh, nice to see you again. I think I know what this goes to, but I'm not sure. Let's try it on one of these locks. It seemed to be the same color. Definitely not. I don't know what the hell I picked up. And I'm not sure if we have lock picks, so... I'm going to go check the other gate. See if we can pick that lock. Yes, sir. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. All right. All right. Got here. Somebody's walking behind me. Just my mannequin friends. They're they're a little weird. Okay, crowbar. Oh my god. Where's that crowbar? I know it's here. Okay. After my parents were taken away, I ended up in the orphanage. There I found friends and it seemed I became happy. The monster that lived in me calmed down and stopped appearing. I wanted to find a family that would accept me for who I really was. A normal. A normal. Okay. Everybody wants to be a normal. All right. So, in the picture, it said there was a crowbar here, but I'm not seeing it. There's got to be something else here. Got to be. God, my throat hurts. My throat is knotted up like crazy. The ambience in this game, the sound effects, the graphics... The storyline, the jump scares. This is a total package, man. Here we go. Here we go. Need bolt cutters. Good God, man. It's one hell of a puzzle game. Okay, so we're looking for bolt cutters, and we are looking for a crowbar and some kind of weird demonic key. I don't know. Guys, you, you have to let me know what you think of this game. A lot of people say I hype games up that shouldn't be hyped up. I think I'm pretty honest with my uh, review on games. And this one is uh, this one is legit. No matter how hard you try, they will admit that you're an unusual child. I want them to understand that. Why are you hindering me? How much longer are you going to put up with me being locked in the basement? We need freedom. I need a plan to get rid of them. Let me do it. I don't. I don't. I'm not sure if I read that before. I think I did. Ah, oh, damn. Okay, bolt cutters and a crowbar. We're gonna go back this way. See if there's anything we missed. You know what I did forget to do? I forgot that I had a camera. I got. I got to take pictures. Oh my fucking god! Another photo that needs to sh shake. Yeah, let's shake it. Yeah, buddy. Okay. You know, I, I kind of forgot about that. There we go. Take it. Give me that crowbar. Okay. Found the crowbar. Easy peasy. Lemon nut sacks. I totally forgot about that part. I totally forgot I had a camera. Oh, God! Morgan! Your mom's walking around in her gown again! 
Okay, we got the crowbar. Let's get through here. I don't I don't want to get through here, but you have to. What's that? I don't want to turn around. I know I'm gonna have to. <laughs> yep, ladder. Okay. Hi! Why, wow, cool place you got here. Really cool. Yep. I like it. I think it's awesome. Uh, achievement unlocked from day to day. That is, yeah. Okay, cool. And pictures of the brain. Very educational. I found where that thing goes, though, at least. Right there. It worked. It looks like the lock in the basement has opened. Yeah, but there's three locks. Okay, so how do we get back to the basement? Maybe that? Yeah, that works. This, this, ha this hallway, man. Look at this hallway. Ugh. Come on, baby. Yeah, one of the locks came off. Excellent. We still need bolt cutters. I didn't see any up there. Going back up stairs because I want to. We have no bolt cutters. Why it won't let me go in here? Ooh, what's this? My mother punished me and locked me in a room. After you left, Dad, she started treating me badly. That's a pretty cool looking letter, though. Oh, man. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, there's the bolt cutters. Where the hell is that? That's in the barn? See? Yeah, okay. I got gotcha. you. So now we need to go to the barn and take a picture. Gotcha. Gotcha. Very, very well made game. It still blows me away that this is a Miss Survival House. I can't remember if Summer of 58 was like this. I play so many horror games, man. I forget, like, all the details of most games. Okay, so I remember seeing one of these beams in it. Right there. There it is. Okay, camera time. Bam. Yeah. Shake it up. Grab it. Gotcha. Don't fuck with me. Don't fuck with me. Oh, fuck you. Yep. Okay. She's just cracking her neck. No big deal. No big deal. Oh, my God. I guarantee. Guarantee you that we find another plug, if not both of them, in this chest. I'm trying to speed run this, man. I want to get this over with. Shit's really getting to me. There's one of them. What the hell? Steven and Nancy. That's a good looking couple right there. Dig the hair. Steve and Nancy. Okay. They kind of look like assholes. Okay. <laughs> Took a little break. Back in the game. Nitchy. 
That wasn't there before. Okay, so we now we've got... God, man, no mind. Hmm. Now we've got to go to the attic. Oh, God. In here. Pull the lever. All right. Hey, guys. Did you miss me? Awesome. Awesome. Now what? Bros. I feel pretty stupid right now. Been looking around for a while, but <laughs> the last button was literally sitting on the desk. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I know you guys are probably screaming at the camera, but at least we got it now. There we go. Achievement unlocked. The passage is open. She's gone. Clown is breathing. Okay. Let's go see where this door leads. Bad feeling right now. Yep. Nope. Are we good? Ah! Hmm. I fucking bit my lip. Yeah, cool. Okay. Doors open. Dude, Let's go. Okay, I'm, I won't say nothing. You spit my ear. There, yep, there's some, we're missing one piece. It's a subway train. Cool. Damn. You ought to start an Instagram. It's on her neck. It's in her hand. Thank, thank you. Thank you. My friend Bigfoot. Barbara Finch. Power box. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Thank thank you for helping me with everything. Okay, let's thoroughly inspect this basement. There's a VHS player right there. Inserting. Crouch down. Come on, play it. There we go. A child who craves parental love becomes rejected because he is not like that. I need to help Phil to find freedom. I calmed down when Phil was safe. Okay, that's literally on the screen. Okay, I read it. Next. After the accident, Phil asked me to help him get his family back. We tried many times, but it didn't work out, and Phil only got worse. I like that they leave the, uh, the damn words on the screen long enough for you to read them. Yeah, good job, devs. So far, not a single complaint. I was left alone. I decided that if we couldn't get his real family back, then I could find a new one. While I was thinking about it, I remembered our house where we were together and decided to take a look at it. We, we do need dialogue, though. You, you can ask me, and I will do some dialogue for you. See, look, I'll read it in dialogue voice. When I got home... I saw a baby. Phil could take care of him. See? I tried to convince Phil to go to Father's Day celebration on Sunday, saying that your life would change there. But he refused. I'm a professional voice actor, okay? I'll only charge $1,000 a minute. Then I went there myself, wearing my best outfit. I wanted to amuse the children. I met my father with a child. I was that boy from our house. He treated him badly. He wasn't his real father. I made sure he was left alone and went over to him. His name was Peter. I can do girl voices too.
Oh my god, that sucked. Your subconscious is more adequate than you, and you must understand that you are evil. You made your parents monsters. They killed Peter's parents because of you. Emma lost JJ because of you. What in the hell kind of party is this? I'm gonna stand. How many horror games have I played where I'm in a room full of naked mannequins with ass in my face? I came home after school. My mom was in bad mood. I can do a kid's voice, too. I came home after school. My mom was in a bad mood. I Whoops. What? Bro. And we're back here. Excellent. No flashlight. Can't climb the ladder. Oh, Phil's diary. We've already read that. Emma, your neighbor doesn't bother you anymore. I can do a girl's voice, too. Emma, your neighbor doesn't bother you anymore? I know you're kind to him, and your son likes him. That's an old woman. But he seems strange to me. His name is Phil, and he lives alone. I've got something on him. He had a family. They got into a car accident, and his wife and child died. After that, he moved into an apartment in your house. I don't think you should talk to him. Oh, wait, that's your brother, Jonathan, so that would be a manly voice. Whatever. You, you get the point. This is the letter I sent to Emma. That son of a bitch stole it. Knew he was guilty. <sighs> yep. Yep. Can I have my flashlight, please? That would be awesome. Okay, we can't leave, so whatever the hell's going on in this small-ass area, we gotta figure out. I don't need any presents. Please let us go. We are very scared. Is that a kid? Yeah, that's kid writing. That's a little boy. I, I don't know. What? <laughs> I don't know. I don't need any presents. Please let us go. You're very scared. I'm real manly, so it's hard to do a little boy's voice. I can do a little girl's voice. <laughs> anyway. Okay, there were monsters and JJ something. I, I need to quit acting stupid. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. I'm stupid. All right, all right. Got the camera back. Oh, door's open. Uh, thank you for turning that off. Appreciate it. God, not this again. Not this again. What the hell is that? Sure, I'll take that. And if anybody fucks with me, they're getting it straight to the dome. Oh, fuck it, you know. Okay, so... Uh, I'm assuming this goes here. Come on, work. Break the lock. I'm never going to make it in that damn cellar. What is that? What the fuck? Aha. Uh -huh. No, no. Is that a trolley motor? What the hell is it? No, it's a grinder. That was a trolley motor. The disc angle grinder is damaged. It's not enough. What? What? <coughs> I got an angle grinder. <coughs> or a grinder. See, I told you. The eyes are open now. And I'm going to turn around... We got any fish? Catch some fish up in this bitch, eh? Hear a lot of crying. Here we go. Alrighty. The disc is broken. We sound pretty high up here. Get a little bit scared, are you? Together I gotta come forever. all the way back down there now. <laughs> Act six. Uh, did see why was there dialogue right there? It sounded like a stupid clown. A lot of people are afraid of clowns. I am not. I'm not one of those people, man. 
You know, it's funny, man. Back in elementary school, we had this assignment where everyone had to write what they wanted to be when they grew up. Everybody had to write what they wanted to be, and obviously everybody was like, doctor, police officer, firefighter. You know what I drew on that piece of paper? I drew a fucking clown. I wanted to join the circus and make people laugh. Wouldn't you know it? I definitely joined the circus, and I think I make people laugh. The Circus of YouTube. This is not, this is not going to be good. This is like the world's worst setting for jump scares and shit. Oh, Whoa, Morgan. That was funny. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's coming from our mouth. Where's my clown shoes? Whoa, hey, kids. What's your name? Aren't you here with your parents? Yeah, Morgan, where's your mom? My name is Peter. I'm on a holiday with Dad. Come here, Peter. <laughs> your dad lost you. He asked me to help find a boy with dark hair whose name is Peter. Come on, I'll take you to him. Oh, my God. I'm gonna fall for it. <laughs> Good. Come on, Peter or Morgan. A few hours later. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Whoa! Hey, kids. What? Hi, kids. It's me. <laughs> Need to feed my new friend. Okay, so we kidnapped him. Need to feed him. Let's let's give him some pizza and an egg. And that's actually a pretty cool combination. I like that. Okay, we're we're good friends. A wormy ass pizza. Well, look at that. Look at that. Where where the clown? <laughs> Hi, Mom. <laughs> I'm hungry too. Okay, I can do a way better. Clown. I can do a way better clown voice than that. Yep. <laughs> hey, kid. <laughs> so creepy. Yep, we're the clown. There's our clown nose. Oh, oh. Going to sleep now. Delicious. Would you like some eggs and pizza? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, going to sleep. It's a very small house. It's not even considered a house. It's a shack. few days later. It's a big ass game, man. News times. The police are looking for a boy 10 years old named JJ. Police officers and volunteers were sent to search for him. Act 7. Darkness comes out. Okay, I think we're back at the apartment. Yes, we are. Bastard. Bastard. Achievement unlocked Act 7. Alright. Clown. Father's Day. Father's Day. Wow, this is weird. Oh shit, where's the TV at? Where's my flashlight? There it is. Uh, I'll be taking that. The flashlight doesn't work. Okay. Basement door opened. Excuse me. Shh. Uh, okay. All right. Never been in this room. What the hell was that? Father's Day. Let's watch together. Rewinding. Play. 
I want to sit in a chair. Sure, yeah. Go go right ahead. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> It's a pretty good laugh. I'll give him that. Act eight. Don't leave alive. The battery on the video camera is dead. Oh my god. It's locked. Somewhere here, he hides the key. So are we... God, it keeps jumping back and forth so much. I'm assuming... Yeah, I don't, I don't know. All right. Need to find the key. There's our flashlight. There's the key. I will be taking that. Flashlight works. <laughs> oh, fuck! Yeah. Yeah, buddy. That was us. Um, yeah, we've got we've got somebody in there, I think. Okay. Obviously locked. Confused boxes. I want to be very thorough with this. Busted bricks. There's a passage behind the wall. Okay. I am prepared. Kinda. All right. I can open this ventilation gate with a screwdriver. Awesome. I see what appears to be a clown back there, but I can't tell. Okay. What the hell do we have here? Screwdriver. There's one right there. Oh, shit! Okay. All right, calm down, man. Okay, on the other side of the vent there. Turn off this damn pressure. That hurt us? Oh, yeah, it hurts. It hurts. It hurts. You're dead. Achievement unlocked. Here we go. Grab the valve. Oh, wait, wait. Locked to need a key. Okay. We went back through the vent. What the hell, man? So. Damn, bro. Aha. There we go. That was, that was weirding me out. Okay. Excellent, excellent. Okay, need a key for that. I fucking hate those clowns. We have a freaking sledgehammer. Sledgehammer! Here we go. This reminds me of the, uh, the basement. In, uh, that old movie, man. What the hell is it? What the fucking hell? What was that? Um, Stir of Echoes. Where they put that little girl in the wall. That was... Fucked. That movie fucked me up so bad. So there's something in here. Oh my god. I'm, I'm getting really gassy. This game gets worse and worse. Here you will need a step ladder to climb. Okay. So a set of keys. You can now open the box, which is in the pantry. I I, I know what's about to happen, alright? It's been a while. That's disgusting. It's, come on and get it over with. I know what's coming. Come on, do it! Okay, let's go to the pantry. Come on. Go ahead, do it. Okay. 
Box one. The hell is that? I don't have a clue as to what that goes to. Um. Yeah. Those look kind of like pipes. I, I don't know. Handlebars. <laughs> ah! Okay. Yep. Told you. Told you. I was ready for it that time. Step ladder. Step ladder. I know we didn't pick up a damn step ladder, so that dude got out of there. He was in there, and now he's out. That son of a bitch. Step ladder. There we go. Okay. All right. Come on, do it again. I know you're going to do it. Damn step ladder. Aha. Uh -huh. They were handles. Low eighty. Achievement unlocked. Don't get caught. I mean, did we just like literally escape? Need to take a flashlight. All right, all right, gotcha. No problem. No problemo. Oh my God! Take the bell in the phone booth to save progress of the game. Okay. Did did we just save it? Because there's stuff. Oh my God! It's that fucking clown. Yeah. You know what? You know, I, I kind of remember this. Did, have we played this before? Because I remember this part. I can't remember if we played a demo that was like this. But if it was the same demo, then it was... Need a coin. Then uh, it was the end of this game. Yes, it was. I have played this before. Holy crap, we played the demo to this. That was such a long time ago, though. But yeah, the demo was literally just like just this part of the game. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're dead. And I can't remember. Okay, I remember we have to repair a ride. One of the rides we have to repair. There's not enough details. What? Okay, all right. I can't remember. It's there's something over here. Can't quite remember what it is. Where is it? Okay, that's how we get down from here. All right, maybe it's on the merry-go-round. I, I don't know what we're looking for. I really don't. Oh, shit. There's another telephone booth. Oh, shit. Okay, he's going away. They must have changed it. His movements are really pissing me off. They must have changed it because in the demo, I remember finding a piece to fix one of the chairs on the roller coaster. And then to get out of here, we needed to ride the roller coaster. And then I think the roller coaster crashes. I'm not sure. I can't remember. Okay. We're going to go over here. We're going to save the game. There we go. Game saved. There we go. I can't remember if this is light sensitive or... 
Aha. It's locked. I can open it with a sharp object. Okay, okay. All right. Sharp object. I see something in her head. Got it. Ha ha. Too damn good. Come on, baby. Come on. Grab it. I don't know what the hell that was, but I'm saving the damn game. Oh, shit. Please turn around. Please. He steam he, He's just standing there. What is he? I think he's lagged out. I don't want to get close to him. Let's go for it. He sees me. Oh, my God. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, he can't follow me. He can't follow me. Oh, my God. I'm dead. Oh. Oh, we got some coins. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay, so we found that wheel. We found some coins. I don't know why the hell we would need a damn soda pop. Orange crush nuts. Awesome. Oh. Oh. How the hell am I supposed to drink that? I'm saving it, dude. I ain't playing no games. Alright, let's save it. There we go. Saving. Alright, so... Turn, let's turn off our light. I think that might have been what caused him to see us. I don't, I don't know. Where the hell is he? There he is. He's right there. Right where we need to go. What the hell is he doing? You gotta be shitting me, dude. Well, I guess I'm gonna try to sneak around him. That's where good old Phil. See, man, a lot of child predators are in places like this. That's the scary damn thing about like hiring people for certain positions. You really have to have a background search. And a lot of them don't even have backgrounds. That's the scariest thing. Phil, the kidnapping clown. Mm. All right, man. He, we got to move him. He's not moving. What the hell is he doing? Ah! Phil? I think I'm dead. Okay, he's, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Nope, he's coming back. We're dead. Okay. Uh. uh that, I think that's our last coin. Key. Key to what? Now I can open the lock door in the basement. It's time to go back. Huh? Okay. Time to go back, I guess. Eh, we got to get past him. That's so crazy, man, because it, it feels like I played the demo for this like two years ago, at least two years ago. Oh, fuck. And I'm not even 100% sure if it was the demo for this game, but it was exactly like this. The hell's that? Nothing. Okay. Uh, going back in the basement. So we can get the hell out of here. Where was... Ah! Thank you.
Thank you very much. Oh shit, what the fuck? Um, yeah, oh fuck! Going this way. No, we're not. How long is this game? Not that I'm complaining. Not complaining a bit. Get the hell out of here. Wrong door. Oh, buddy was locked in here with a bunch of alcohol? Oh, fuck. All right, okay, I can't stand that sound. Okay, there's a crowbar right there too. Gotcha. What did I do? Did I fuck up? Closet. Awesome. Locos. Well, we've got a snack bar here. That's that's pretty cool. Morgan, hey man, calm down. I'll help you out. Uh, open the gate. Locked. Okay, how 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 do we open that? There's a there's a bus woke here right there. There we go, keys. There we go. A bird in a cage. She's been unlocked. I found the boy, Peter. He was alone in that room. Peter told me that there were two more children. I couldn't find them. I couldn't find JJ. Phil hid the information about where he hid them. Maybe I should try again? I'm sure I can find them. Right now, it's not necessary. We are at an impasse, an impasse, an impasse again? Phil is not as simple as it seems. I have a suspicion of that. Otherwise, let's leave now. We are starting the next system startup. That's the creator. I read, I'm so, my nervous system is so shot. I can't read. I can't read to begin with. Act nine. Some places never let go. We're back in the apartment. You know how I know? I hear water. That boy, his name was Peter, was special. I would never hurt him. He was lonely like me. The man he called his father was a monster. I wanted to save him from this world. Okay. Are you starting to remember what you did? Uh, no. Okay, everything's normal. The flashlight doesn't work. Okay, back in the basement we go. My order has arrived. Okay. I am so confused. Uh, what I'm doing is not real. There's no time machine. But where is the reality in which everyone is happy? I'm confused. I can't take it anymore. You know, I'm asking the same question. I would like to find that reality. Oh my God. <sighs> I brought friends for him, brought a lot of toys and food. I wanted to be a real father to him. He shouldn't have felt bad, and he was happy. I did everything for this. 
The other kids were misbehaving, and I had to calm him down, or calm them down. I don't understand why they call me a maniac. Kids love the clowns. Oh, okay. Creator, you've been silent for 20 years, and you still think you're innocent? Show me where the children's bodies are hidden. So what I'm getting from this is, uh, that, oh God. Oh God, I fucking knew it. You know what? I don't care what I've gathered from this. I'll tell you at the end. Nice ass. We have reached an impasse again. Are starting another reboot of the system. So the police are delving into Phil's mind. I had to fix it. I'll tell you everything. Okay. Court decision. Defendant Phil Harris was sentenced to death by electric chair for the abduction and murder of two children. Oh, what? They're digging something up. They found them. Ah, so they found it. Court decision. He moved the bodies many times trying to hide them. Eventually, they were found on the territory of the house. Harris buried them in a place where the van was standing. The third child was saved. Okay. Court decision. During the investigation, the pilot project, Golden Egg, was involved. Thanks to him, we got recognition from Harris. So, Harris was the police officer, right? Creator. In the Golden Egg, we discovered that Phil Harris suffered from multiple personality disorders. Okay, his mind divided into two different people. Gotcha. That makes a little bit more sense now. Uh, the depressed Phil who withdrew into himself thinking that he could prevent the death of his family and the, 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 dom the dominant personality of the clown who had not manifested himself since childhood. Huh. Creator. Since the clown controlled him in real life, I think the real Phil helped Jonathan find the place where the children were hidden. Okay. Holy crap. Creator. He couldn't fix his mistake, but he had to help those families. Wow. Yeah. Sweet, 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 sweet. Another badass ending. We'll wait for the credits, and then we'll see if there's anything at the end. So strange, man. Like, that's how you do a video game, man. Right there. The clown part? Eh. Rest of the game was insane love this music man hope i don't get copyright hit for it bro love this music love it very awesome there's a lot of people in the development of this game a small team but still a lot of people soundtrack in the main menu Weezlack, red nose nice Soundtrack by Weezlack. Astrio. I really hope this isn't copywritten. Because this is very rad. Outro soundtrack. Weezlack. Oslaw. Origins. Excellent. Excellent. I dug that very much. Holy crap, my nervous system is shot. That's how you know you've played a good scary game. <laughs> when you're really tired afterwards. Operator, Jonathan didn't find Sergeant Henry. What are we going to do? What? Creator, do not disconnect it from the system. I'll find something to tell the police.
Henry, achievement unlocked Father's Day forever. I'm in this place again. What? What? It's not over. It's not over. <laughs> it's not over. Oh my God. It's just like a little, maybe like a special bonus or whatever. Okay. Let's check it out real quick. See, that's why I always wait. For the end credits. Good God. Look at all the asses. A lot of asses in here. It's a damn mannequin maze. The fuck is that? Bro. What the hell am I looking at? We're going to get like some kind of special achievement for this. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Walking back through. Man, dude, I started this game out and I was fine. I'm extremely gassy now. And I don't think this path was here before. It is not over. What in the shit? Oh my god, that is terrifying, dude. I would like to buy two tickets, please. Oh, there's a coin. Oh my god. Coin collector achievement unlocked. Oh, awesome. You can't get enough people to come to your carnival. Just make a bunch of mannequins. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Look, I'm, I'm cool with this. Just no more jump scares, please. Please. Okay. This was definitely wasn't here before. Let's just keep him. Let's just keep moving. So the uh, the officer is still in the simulation. God, man, you guys are gonna have to help me make sense of the story down in the comment section, please. Please, is that one of the kids? Okay, demon just grabbed her. Yeah, man, the music in this game is insane. I'll definitely be checking out the soundtrack. <laughs> crying. <laughs> Henry crying. <laughs> and the subway. <laughs> I can't move. <laughs> I remember the picture of the subway in the in the puzzle, but and we can't move. Oh, God. Yeah, we are stuck, man. We cannot move. <laughs> Phil, you're mine forever now. His second personality got stuck in the simulation. Wow. We wow we wow. Yes. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. That's what a video game should look like and feel like and sound like. Very awesome. Uh, <laughs> so if uh, you want to support the channel, check me out on Utreon. I have a banned gameplay series. It's the best series I've ever done for the $10 tiers and up. Completely unfiltered Mad Vlad. It's stuff I can't put on YouTube. That's how bad it is. Check me out on Instagram. 
Check out the merch. It's dope. And I live stream on the weekend. All the links are down in the description if you want to go check them out. I love you guys. And never forget, watch your kids in any type of amusement park. That's all. Have a good day.